What's going on everybody? This is Mr. CH Vlogs. We're coping here. So we have a little hallway right now because the mall is actually getting renovated so I can't uh, like the mall is like right there. But uh, it's a little bit more crowded here because the hallway is a little bit smaller and everything, so I decided to come in here and do this. So Basically, uh, all I went to school today was for for a quiz. Uh, I didn't go in the morning. I haven't been feeling good too much today, but I don't know where my house keys are, so I can't actually get back into my house, which sucks. So I'm just gonna walk around the mall for a little bit. Mom is actually at the dentist right now because she lost part of her tooth last night, unfortunately. So she's doing that right now, and then I'm gonna meet her at home. So as I'm walking past all the mobile boutiques right now in the mall, it's reminding me of the fact that um, in the next probably month and a half to two months, I'm gonna be getting a new phone, which I'm really happy about. It's the OnePlus 6 that just dropped, I think actually early this morning, and it looks like such a good phone at like not a flagship price, you know, because um, I think the one I'm getting retails for about 750 Canadian, which is about, which is also free shipping, so it shouldn't be too bad at all. Obviously there's tax on top of that, but uh, 750 Canadian is not a bad price for a flagship phone at all. It got 8 gigs of RAM and 128 gigs of storage and dual, and dual cameras in the back with a 20 megapixel and a 16 megapixel with optical image stabilization, which would be good for this. Um, uh, for some reason, I can't get the DSLR that I want because it's too expensive or anything. I know I'm getting this new phone anyway, which is going to certainly be a step up from this because, believe it or not, it has 4K video recording at 60 FPS, which is a lot better than this phone. So look forward to that. I'm just, I'm really hyped about this phone. So you may hear me talk about it a few times. I'm just, I'm so hyped about this phone. Um, the only problem I'm seeing as far as I've asked three of mobile boutiques in here about cases for it, and they say they never get any cases for the OnePlus series phone. So chances are I'm going to have to order uh, cases for it online. I'm walking past Cinnabon right now. I want some so bad. I might get some later. Oh, it smells so good. So I'm in Sport Check right now and I'm trying to find a pair of shoes that actually fit me. I've been walking around the entire mall because I have huge ass feet, a size 15 feet, and no one has like nicer shoes. I mean, like I want something like an NMD or a Yeezy or something. You know, I want like a nice shoe. So. I, I haven't looked into it at all to be honest, I haven't researched this at all, but like I'm just, I'm trying and I can't seem to find any, so I think I'm probably just going to have to go online and try to find it, which sucks, but I can't do anything about it, that's just how I was born, I got big ass feet, it sucks, but I can't do anything about it, but now I'm actually going to go look at punching bags, because I actually want to see if I can get into kickboxing and things like that, so I figured that maybe having a punching bag and some gloves at home would kind of be a good starting point, plus a good cardio workout, so try to shed the pounds, right? Just finished up looking at the punching bags and stuff like that in uh, Sport Check. Now I'm actually heading into Hudson's Bag and look around here for a little bit. But um, it ended up not being as much as I would have thought it was. Uh, it ended up being somewhere around the $300, $350 range for gloves, the training mitts, and the punching bag. I was expecting at least $500, so that's good. Ended up getting some Chinese food from Tiki Ming in Place d'Orleans. Um, big shout out to them for probably the best Chinese food. Uh, fast food Chinese food that I've ever had plus uh, the woman was really nice she actually I couldn't decide between fried noodles and fried rice so what she decided to do she's like oh we can just mix both and anyway I ended up getting General Tso's chicken and orange chicken so again big shout out to them this is really really good so on the way up here I ended up getting uh, two new kinds of XL gum uh, this one's sweet mint and I also got another one called chlorophyll so I don't know what the hell that one's gonna taste like but I'm going to try the sweet mint right now. Um, generally, I don't like too sweet of gums, so I hope this is okay, but I've never seen them before, so I decided to try them, especially because um, I need some gum after uh, Chinese food. I couldn't even finish it all. There was so much there, I couldn't even finish it all, so, you know, I'm like, I'm really full now, and like, there's like easily 10 pieces of chicken left, and like, I would have just been throwing up, so I'm going to try the gum now. It smells extremely minty, so... That's an interesting flavor. I don't really know if I like it. It's, it's really minty though, so... But... It's okay, but... I don't know if I get it again. I'm actually gonna head over to Mastermind Toys now. I've been looking for an RC car, and I'm gonna see if they 
sell any ones that look like half decent because I've only been seeing ones that are around like 20 kilometers an hour and they're like really cheap plastic so I'm gonna go in there and see if they sell any better. It look like they had exactly the thing I was looking for but I'll keep looking. Uh, I might check Amazon later tonight see what they got. Actually the Wish app seems kind of, like a, kind of a good idea too. Everything's pretty cheap on there and apparently they've gotten a lot better with shipping times and everything. People are getting stuff in two three weeks which would not be too bad so I'm gonna go check that. So the sweet mint has pretty much lost its taste now. I'm gonna end up trying this XL chlorophyll gum now. Um, I, I, I don't have high hopes for this because if you actually look at it, here, I'll try to take one out of the package here for just a sec or here. Uh, you can look at it through the package. It's got, it, it's like a green, grainy look to it. So I actually don't know what it is, but I'm gonna try it and let you guys. So I'm about to try the gum now, the chlorophyll gum. I have to add when I smelled it, it smelled like a plant. Um, yeah, I don't know how I feel with this one. This one's certainly worse than the sweet mint. Um, I, don't, uh, I don't know. I don't know if it's just mentally, you know, I think I'm eating chlorophyll, but oh. Mm, that is not my favorite thing. Maybe what it says, right? Yeah, chlorophyll. Yeah. I certainly wouldn't get that one again. The sugar, or the, the sweet mint one, maybe, but I wouldn't get this one again. This one's a little weird to me. But if you guys have tried it, uh, let me know down in the comments what you thought of it. So, just driving back home now. Mom came to pick me up, so thank you. Um, we ended up having to stop at a grocery store, get some food for dinner. Um, and then there's a the dollar store right beside the grocery store, so Megan and me just ended up going in there. And I ended up getting something, I've seen them a few times, but never got them. Um, my apologies, lots of bumps on this road, I'm trying to hold my phone steady as I can, but I've seen them before, and I've never tried one, and it's the white Kit Kat, so I'm gonna try it now, see how it is. It's good. Not as good as a chocolate Kit Kat. It's good, but not as good. <laughs> so. It's kind of weird, isn't it? It's like a cookie. Yeah. It's like chocolate milk in the middle. I actually like it better than the original ones. Because you like white. Yeah. I like white chocolate better. Mom, that's racist. Yeah, go ahead. Oh, that, I don't know. I didn't think that it was as good. So this is Megan trying the XL gum. This is the sweet mint. Sweet mint. Oh, it's really hard. That's what she said. Oh my god! It's really minty, eh? It's really oh. minty. Mm -mm. So this is Megan trying the chlorophyll one. It's from the dentist. Go ahead. It tastes like a car. <laughs> How do you know what a car tastes like? Good question. Like the new smell? Yeah, I said grab it. It's 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 not good, eh? So I just realized something a little funny. Uh, I realized that the description that I've had in all my videos, um, well, not really you. sort of. Um, half of the links aren't going to the right profiles anymore because I changed my usernames. So. Uh, this one, uh, this, I, I'm going to be going through and changing them all, and this one will be the first one I'm actually going to be able to post with the right ones in it. So, there's that. I'm to try touch with you all this time. Um, Jerky. so, now that they're correct, I feel like it's a good time to plug all my social media, 
So go follow at Real Mr. CH on Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, and Musically. Uh, I also have a Facebook page. Um, I'm not too active on there. I'm going to be 100% honest with you. So, you know, do what you will with that. But make sure you go follow my Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, and Musically. I'm the most active on all of those, and I am always following people back. So go check out all of those. Uh, I've actually, like I said uh, yesterday, I've been trying a little bit harder on my Instagram now. Like, I'm actually, like, not just taking random selfies and putting stupid little captions. Like, I'm actually trying. And it's weird. Because now, people are unfollowing from me and it doesn't make any sense. I'm trying harder and people are unfollowing me. Oh. Like, I, I, like, it, it, it just doesn't make any sense to me. Aww. Like, it, it makes no sense whatsoever. No, it makes no well, sense. I'm confused by what you're saying. It makes no sense at none. At none. At none. I have nothing. Makes no sense, eh, mom? Yeah, at none. Like it, it doesn't go. It, it, it makes no sense. But anyway, go make sure to follow at Real Mr. Ch on Snapchat, Musically, Instagram, and Twitter, and to get notified um, every time I post. Make sure that you turn on all the post notifications for all those social media accounts. Um, it's usually just up in the top right corner of all of the little social media apps, so go make sure you turn on all my post notifications. The hermit's back downstairs. She came back down from her room. She's literally just like a hermit, though. You just come downstairs to grab food and then leave again. Oh, well, there's her favorite shirt in the world. Yeah. The 11 Ego shirt. Well, no, it's because it is, is it not? Hmm. What it is. Yeah, if you guys didn't know, Megan is obsessed with Stranger Things and everything Millie Bobby Brown. So, you know, that shirt was a, uh, a major plus this Christmas.